Tell me to pray, tell me to stay in my lane Tell me not to go insane, ayy Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to another video! It's your girl Kiva, yet again, yet again Um, I, I think I'm gonna put this one on my channel Just cause we still haven't did the other one But yeah, y'all, um My next video I will be dropping Um, the basketball game with me and him one on one and y'all just let me know what y'all think i'm not gonna really speak on it too much i really didn't want to post it too tough because i don't know if everybody get my sense of humor i'm real goofy especially in competitive when when me and him playing one-on-one -on -one. so or anything that's competitive between me and him we just be talking crap so, so y'all just stay tuned and um i don't even know what we about to get into entirely today but it is kind of late and yeah just bear with us I cannot believe it's raining right now. Like, it's no way that so long to even try to drop some rain, not want to rain. I'm, I'm kind of heated about that. Right? Like, what am I supposed to do now? I was planning on going for a walk, doing all kind of stuff, you feel me? Give me a nice little photo shoot today because today is the one day that I decided that I really want to look decent. And now, here it go. It want to rain. Right, Done too. killed I my little plan. Little, little sauce, you know what I'm saying? Y'all wonder why I'm begin dressed and I don't be caring about none of this stuff because always every time some every time I do do makeup or something something like this happens it's always some kind of blockage you know what I mean like just forget it so y'all I was talking to a few of y'all on Instagram about music wise and why I haven't dropped my music the way I wanted to and I didn't expect everybody in the business to be shady like. I didn't expect everywhere that I go that I got to really look over my shoulder and really look into people. It's dark, 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 like, so demonic. Like, it's crazy that people, they will literally try to hustle you out your money. And, you know what I'm saying? Like, with the shower situation, I made that song months before I even got in the studio and recorded it. And it took me a while to even find somebody that I thought I probably could trust you know to to do the music and turns out he was another goofball too like and i'm not trying to talk down on nobody or nothing but i'm just telling you straight up what it was so anyway long story short i go to him and he has somebody in the studio and this is and need i remind you yet again i went through several um producers to get to this guy so let me let you know i'm not joking and and um this dude right so he told me all right he got somebody in the studio you know take take a couple minutes woo -woo. he gonna do what he gotta do finish up with dude all right cool babe me and babe were like well shoot we want to go get something to eat anyway because he was starving i kind of didn't want to eat too much because you know i was gonna be singing and i'm like nah you know but they like yeah look come on let's just go ahead and do it so we do it whatever woo -woo. we gonna get the food yeah, we asked him. He said it was straight. So we left, and mind you, we was gone for like what, thirty minutes? We could have been gone like thirty minutes in drive through, trying to get Brianna Sunny, get him Sunny, and mind you, Brianna was with us as well. So I guess I don't know if that was a red flag to him to see us as a family loving each other and you know how we is or whatever. He gonna try to get money up off of us or whatever. Woo woo. I don't know. So we get back to the studio. And he still got the dude in the studio. Mind you, I had already been gone for like 30 minutes. You know, you definitely pushing it. He acted like I'm supposed to be just like chill about it. And you know, I'm I'm cool about it still. I'm not even showing that I'm angry or upset or nothing. And I'm trying to just keep my composure. Because in the inside, I'm nervous too. Because it's like my first time doing this. And I'm so thankful that somebody even trying to work with me for me trying to see that I've never really done before. So anyway, long story short... This fool, we get in there, he critiquing me and I'm nervous or whatever. He acting like he give me the right pointers and stuff like that. And I'm thinking, okay, maybe he cool and maybe I'm not doing well under pressure because I really felt like my voice couldn't do what he thought I was going to Mariah carry it or something. I couldn't do all that. So anyway, by the time I'm done, 
he only and I paid for two hours mind you and I just didn't know how long it would take I told him I only needed an hour I felt like because I thought I was pretty fast about it but he was saying nah 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 I insisted so we probably was there for like an hour and 15 minutes and he cut off my session and then tell my son oh you know because he tired his ears or whatever he got to do more work at that leave. So he told me he need like another 60 for the work. And I'm like, okay, that's cool. You know, I'm thinking like it's always no, it's no pressure. Then he told me he needed another 40 to send off to his homeboy in Cali that worked with all these big name artists. And, and I'm just like thinking in my head, like, I don't care about who you work with. None of those credentials. As long as you doing what you got to do and helping me, you know what I'm saying? I'm cool about it. I don't care. Like, that's not important to me. So, anyway, long story short, he sent it off the buddy, supposedly, woo woo. And then he told me to get him a few days to master it, everything, and give me back my sound. So, I think that was like literally like two to three days he told me I was gonna have my song. I'm like, cool, no pressure. Like, take your time. I want this project to be nice. So, I get the song back, and I still got producer tags on the song. Now, mind you, he told me he could remove them no problem but i'm thinking i'm tripping like at the time i didn't really know what those was or exactly the power in a producer and exactly what they can do but i didn't realize you know he could really really take those off so i would say like two months went by and i still had that on it and i kind of i kind of was thinking to myself like because i texted him when he sent me the song finalized i texted him i was like you know thank you did a good job on the song what do you do and I'm thinking to myself, I asked him, I said, babe, it, does it sound like this supposed to be in there? Like the song still got a little tag on it that don't sound like it's supposed to be there. But he was like, nah, babe, it, it sounds straight. Like the song sound good to me. So I'm listening out for him, but knowing on the inside that something telling me I need to, you know, talk to dude, I didn't want to be annoying. So I was just like, you know what, whatever, I'm going to leave it. So I would say probably like a month or two literally went by and I realized I'm like, he need to fix this song. I'm not about to put this song out there like that. Instead of him taking the tags all the way off, this fool lowered it to almost the lowest volume, I guess, that you can put it on to and wanted to be a butthole about it. And I'm telling you, I went through so much back and forth. It was so stressful just trying to get my song that I said, I really got to invest in learning this stuff myself. And that's why I haven't dropped no music because you can't even depend on these dudes they're gonna take clean advantage of you they feel like you green they're gonna take clean advantage of you they see you got a loving family they're gonna take clean advantage of you and i ain't got time for that how you gonna sit there and take advantage of somebody you know what i'm saying like why would you do that like i'm paying you the money like you see and then the, the, this is stupidest thing to me this is the stupid part that i don't get if you do your job right you know what i'm saying you're gonna get me back as a customer you're gonna get me plus some i'm gonna refer somebody to you if you do what you're supposed to do and not rip people off and not be shady no he took my money didn't do a dang single thing afterwards but give me some foolishness and i had to fight with him just to get the finalized copy of my song and it still ain't all the way correct and you know what it's fine it's fine it was just supposed to be a little project of mine but i still expected the producers to do his job right especially when you told me you're gonna do your job right so yeah that's just my little rant about it you know what i'm saying like just let me know what y'all think any comments any females out there doing in the rap industry or doing anything in that area and you know and you not heard something let me know just comment down below because i promise you bro it's not it's not a joke like they dead serious is like monsters out here like you got to have some people that's really about to it feel like you got to have a whole strip of security with the straps on you like for real like something because dudes playing like y'all playing with people money like y'all doing too much and i know it's not that serious yes i'm a christian no 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 you're not supposed to be violent la 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 right 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 i get all of that i get all of that because i'm not even trying to take it there but it's i promise y'all it felt like he was trying to pull my character there i was trying to be so nice about it but yeah they'll take clean advantage of you bro like straight up like clean advantage and i'm straight off of that like i want my stuff to be done right and if it gotta be a little altered you know what i'm saying then that's just what it's got to be because i'm gonna have to do all the leg work so i don't know if y'all gonna get an ep out of me soon when exactly because i thought i was gonna be able to drop one at the beginning of 2020 which this was so discouraging and just don't push me back from the music scene yet again like i don't know if i want to be dealing with that so
Just a little friendly reminder. Jesus said I am the way. John 14, 6.